On Tuesday, during the hearing of the misleading advertisements case against Patanjali Ayurved, Acharya Balakrishna and Baba Ramdev, the Supreme Court of India called out the petitioner Indian Medical Association over its doctors allegedly validating unnecessary and expensive medicines in allopathy. In a sharp observation, the Supreme Court stated that while the IMA is pointing fingers at Patanjali Ayurved, four fingers are being pointed at them as well. The Supreme Court noted that the IMA doctors are also endorsing medicines in the allopathic field. So if that's happening, why should the court not turn the beam at IMA? The Supreme Court asked IMA to put its house in order and fix its allegedly unethical acts regarding way to expensive and unnecessary medicines being endorsed. The court also noted that there are several complaints with regard to alleged unethical conduct by IMA. FMCG companies were publishing advertisements of products that affect the health of babies, young children and senior citizens as observed by the court. The Supreme Court has asked the licensing authorities of all states and union territories to take proceedings against the case. The court directed the central ministries to file affidavit concerning the actions they took against misleading advertisements over the past three years. In the meantime, the Supreme Court also reprimanded the Ramdev-owned company's apology in newspapers saying that it should be of the same size as its misleading advertisement. Mukul Rohtagi, who appeared for Ramdev Baba, said that the apology has been published but was reprimanded on another fact that it was only published yesterday.